welcome back guys so welcome to the uh, mouth smile section of the series in the other videos we've created the cheek the brow and uh, the lid if you have not seen them you should go check them out you know before you continue with this one so in this part we'll be creating the left smile x uh the left smile y the left smile x negative the same with uh y negative then the open smile so now uh, i want to explain what this uh my naming conversion means so uh when you look at this uh axis here for the 3d environment the y is obviously the up and then the x is side the z is the one that goes from back to front so i'm going to create for the left smile x i'm going to create a, an expression of the smile that goes towards the x as this which is by the side and i'm going to do the same thing for the up so i'm going to do the x that goes in which is going to be for pot and uh you know kisses and all those kind of stuff then i'm going to do for y negative that means y negative y going down so that one will be for uh for sad uh expression for the mouth so the combination of all these will actually give you the uh for you to give you the exp i mean when you combine the left smile x and y up then you actually get a uh, a very nice uh, uh a smile so it took me a while to actually understand uh, this process even when you are doing uh, a joint based facial rigging you still have to like you know make sure that you have an expression that goes like this and then another that goes up to actually form the the smile so that your smile will not be in one if, if some people like they just sculpt a smile in one you know blend shape and just put it on their expression and so this the smile is just one direction it just goes like that uh which i think is too kind of limited but if you have two things that you can tweak to actually get your smile so you can actually you know make the character smile in so many uh, uh ways so then this open one is for probably when the character is you know smiling maybe a, like a smack or something and then they now have to like open their mouth and then you see the teeth so it's like an open smile basically so um let's get started so i'm going to copy the this and um i'm going to duplicate okay i'm going to duplicate from our templates yeah so i'm going to do some duplicates so that i will probably not be doing this uh you know all over again so i'm going to give this one uh for the smile x so i'll give this uh the smile y and um so let's just go ahead with these two first and then see where we yeah so i'm going to add this to my target uh, so from here i'm going to start editing so basically um i do select the vertices around this part of the mouth um yeah and then when you're doing this selection make sure that you you don't, don't have other places selected so um because i want to draw this to this side sometimes you can just be moving this and stuff my you might not actually get it right so what i do is that i make sure that i'm in a very good uh, angle here so that i can see you know my axis there so you can use d on your keyboard to turn this your uh, manipulator you know into an edit mode so you can change the direction you want the manipulator to go from here so once you have done that you can just hit d on the keyboard again so it will take you back to the manipulator itself then you can now move so you can move so you move you push it as far as you want it to go then i'll just kill it in because when you when you stretch this model of a of a stretch action so you want to make it you know stretch so now there's a problem now the the uh nose is getting along with it which i'm going to probably tweak along the line so when you push it to this end so i'm just going to release this now so it is my brush now that will now probably do the rest so i have to sculpt this 
the nose part of the nose is probably supposed to go with it yes but not too much to make it this kind of obvious so i'm going to so like i said before if you know what your character looks like all this kind of sculpting will probably not give you too much uh, headache uh, so i want a part of the nose to go but not everything so now i'm going to work on this part so uh because there's a scratch and stretch stretch for the lips but squash for the uh for the uh for the cheek area so you're probably going to push this out you're going to push this out because it's uh a squash thing going on here so you push it out very well but you make sure that it's still smooth so then you now have to edit this part so i'm going to probably from here probably bring it in so so basically the mouth just you know goes in and goes in like towards the edge before you now have like a sharp uh, edge somewhere here so this one is supposed to be to, uh -huh. so you want it to be as clean as possible so with your sculpting so um, okay so there's so many ways you can go about sculpting this but you just want it to be as neat as possible and places that are supposed to be squash you make them squash and then you make sure that your edges are evenly distributed with this so so you probably when when the character smile you probably not be going too extreme like this but it's better you push it as much as possible so that when he smile you can always have like a lot of space to do that so i'm going to probably leave that there like that so now uh the next one is uh the y i'm going to just attach it and then i'm going to delete this and then um, um push this one and then so i'm going to select this place and then i think yeah so i'm going to delete inside so all i just need to do is just push this up am i on edit yes i am and then rotate remember you push it up you rotate and because it's stretching up you don't want to pull this thing to be too much like this so because you have already done it for the side there so you have to be very mindful so i'm going to release this from here and then uh maybe probably hey, you want to have something like this so if you check check you check uh i think it has pushed way in so i need to it's not supposed to go more in So it's basically flick is too much. So you want to have a if you once you've done that with uh the vertices there you can still come back and I use um my I, I put my fall off to be volume here so that I can pick volume rather than surface. So you want everything to you want to still have a, a level of uh, curve and then you want to see this part to squash so most times I'll, I'll just smooth them out and then I'll bring the parts that I want I'll bring those ones so there's a bit of a uh, distortion here so I'm going to correct that and then I'm going to push this push this up mm -hmm. then there's a bit of problem here like just need this some tweaks uh, some tweaks yeah so I'll probably bring this here so 
it, as you do it it might not be looking good as you're doing it here but make sure that you make sure that everything is as smooth as possible once you are done and you start to combine it with the uh, smile X right there you'll be seeing a very good uh, no deformation right there so I'm um, going to so I'll not check it out now so um let's say I select both of them and then I move so you see you see the smile right there even though I feel like uh, sometimes the upper part is the <laughs> this one goes more like this so they don't really go even so you know get the smile from there so this is a very good uh, way to make smile so now I'm going to probably duplicate now you duplicate only when you are certain that you like it. sometimes after even doing this I go back to adjust I go back to adjust uh, my deformation so I'm, I, I just duplicate them back to the right side and then so I want to see what it uh, this might will look like from both so it's really not bad you know it's not bad at all it shows that the guy is smiling so um I'm going to just put the uh, brow up to show excitement and maybe uh, I'm going to hide the lashes there then maybe the eye is going to be wide or maybe not well I think it's fairly okay so now uh, when both of the smile eggs like you push them maybe to this end I want to create the combination target so left and right uh, smile X combo so this combination target to I just want to use it to uh, I'm going to pull back to service I want to like when you smile you know you're stretching the lips so I want to just bring this so this only happens when both of them both the left and right side are in action so so you know looks better and then the other thing is i like to push it up when there's a smile so i'm going to probably going to mirror so the lips goes up a little bit so compared to what you have here see So that's his, uh, the smile right there. So I'm going to probably shoot it down. So so that's the smile uh, for you. So um, I'm going to break uh, this video down because I can see that it's shooting beyond uh, uh, 10 minutes. So so the next uh, aspect I'm going to be working on the negative uh, uh, I'm going to be working on the uh, negative uh, of uh, the negative side of what we just did now so I'll catch you guys up in the next video uh, cheers